if you're not 18, you should probably stop watching this video because we're kind of vulgar people and you probably won't like what we have to say. Hi everyone, welcome to Jesus Religion, and uh, this week we did some things uh, involving coolant. So the purpose of this test was to originally uh, prove that cat coolant was uh, a little bit worse than uh, Ford Gold coolant. But, as it turns out, that's not necessarily the case. As you'll see, we're going to show you. So we tested four coolants, um, and we're going to talk to you about what we did, and uh, yeah. So we took the four coolants and measured out an ounce of each of them. And our, the, the purpose of this test was to see how much dropout or sediment there was after we boiled off all of the liquid. So took an ounce of each, boiled it till there was pretty much nothing but powder or crust left and evaluated from there. Alright, who wants to try it first? Who wants to try it first? Yeah, you get like a Are spoon we talking about meth? Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought yeah. we were like, whoa. Yeah, the meth, you know. No, thank you. Oh, okay. Wait. One pop meth? of the drugs. Meth, you don't need <laughs> That's the thing I, I love is doing drugs. That's heroin. Well, meth is when you put a pipe and you, meth and you, pipe. you just yeah. smoke it? Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. It's crack. Yeah. Yeah. Crack rock. I like crack. <laughs> <laughs> do you so heat it from the bottom or do you like burn it? The bottom. <laughs> the bottom. So it's like a glass. So it's still, it's so you just don't use a needle. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Do something yeah, else it. talking about. <laughs> yeah. Solid. A 6.0 oil cooler has a common failure where it will get clogged up with coolant. And that was kind of the basic purpose of this test. Um, we wanted to show what coolant was going to provide the most buildup in the oil cooler. And, uh, So we tested four different coolants. We have heavy duty Napa coolant, uh, extended life conventional AutoZone coolant, CAT ELC coolant, and the Motorcraft Gold coolant. Um, based off of this test, the Ford coolant actually did the worst. It had the most deposits after all the liquid was burned off, and it also seemed to dry up in sheets. Uh, the CAT coolant would say did about the second worst although it had less deposits than Ford it did seem to clump up and I don't know coagulate a little more and it, it definitely dried hard um, surprisingly the AutoZone extended light conventional did better than Ford and Cat based off of this <laughs> test hold on pause you're <laughs> so laughing well I can hear the douche 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 douche, douche <laughs> in the back I know that's gonna be in douche, the douche 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 Auto's unconventional. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on. Shut up. Okay. The... <laughs> Son of a bitch! <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah? You can do it, too! No. <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> uh. Surprisingly, the AutoZone conventional extended life coolant did better than the CAT and the AutoZone based off of our opinion. Although it is only slightly less than CAT, it didn't harden completely and it kind of formed a paste. It, no matter what, it wouldn't evaporate all the way. The best one in our opinion was the um, Napa heavy duty coolant. It had the least amount of residue left over and it was the finest powder out of all of them. Um, so, based off of that, we would assume that the uh, Napa heavy duty coolant would not plug up as much as the other ones would. Uh, in the future, we plan on doing some similar tests, uh, boiling point, and some more specific tests as far as weight and things of that sort. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody knows what it means, but it's provocative. It gets the people going. We'll see you next week. Goodbye. 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 Goodbye.